going on everybody january flowers here your favorite home girl and today we're jumping into the world of zeus network honey now before we go into the main story i just got some croissant like tea Krishan has been issued a bench warrant yes yes Yes, it's a lot going on in the world of Sean. I thought ever since Blueface so, went down, a bench warrant has been issued for Krishan violating her probation. It looks like the state is asking a judge to revoke her probation and keep her locked up for the remainder of her sentence, which is until 2027, y'all. They not playing with her. It looks like this is a Los Angeles, California bench warrant issue for Krishan. I don't know if she's currently in California, but it looks like there is a bench warrant and they want her to finish out the remainder of her sentence. <laughs> a lot going on in the world of the baddies and, and bad and bougie hey. sharice mills and the wine seller like asap <laughs> so today's video is basically about sharice mills she's currently going around doing interviews to promote her new show baddie and the beast now, amongst doing interviews, I remember on her WAC 100 review, we did a two-parter breaking down that interview when she was when she responded to the question WAC was asking her about Lemmy and Zeus Network. So Sharice is on Tasha K show, and during the Tasha K interview, Tasha brought it up. You know what about these allegations? So Sharice gives her peace, but y'all y'all got to get into the shade of her responses because. One thing about Tasha, she loves to ask the deeper details. So Tasha was like, well, what was it like? You've already admitted to sleeping with the Zeus heads. What was it like? So, of course, you know, she doesn't say much about Janisha, except she feels a little sorry for her and that there is no marriage to the point that it's no engagement, which is wild. But she does clear it up and says that everything she's been doing behind the scenes with Zeus is all consensual. She was doing it to lock in a spot. She says she saddened that she had to. But during a bedroom play with Lemmy, she says she literally had to pick him up and position him in different positions. Now, of course, Tasha K chuckles and things like that. Even her man looking around the room. But my thing is, I've always heard the jokes about him being tiny and everything like that. But Sharice is short herself. And for her to say she had to pick him up and put him in different positions. Girl, what is it giving? But y'all. She also spilled tea on the payout. So one thing about Reese, she been saying in every interview, she's about her cash. So she got the spot. But outside of whatever she made from doing the show, when she was doing the situations with um, Lemmy and Janisha, she said that was 50K a pop over. She said over 50K a pop. So he's definitely willing to pay, just like Tasha K is saying. I'm going to let you guys check out this clip and you'll hear what she said yourself with Zeus though. Girl, why we gotta bring that up? Yeah, I need to know what happened with Lemmy. Cause they, they on his ass right now. They Listen, talking about he, he giving no. girls <sighs> giving girls STDs and stuff. He's Thank God that was shit. before my time. Shit. So you was with Lemmy? Girl, you see, I don't like talking about this. I would have never spoke on if this. If I didn't have to. Like, I'm not here to out anybody. Okay. Let's get that to, get that straight. Okay. I did what I did. What'd you do? Consensually. Okay. Have you his, know? Okay. Yeah, we had relations. Okay. You know, it was a situation. How was that? Because he's so little. Girl, it was, you know, I had to pick him up and like move around. It was a, one of those moments, you know? I'm not even going to lie. We I, need I more really... water for this. <laughs> <laughs> it was one of those moments. And I'm not going to lie. I really, I really had this, this man thinking like he had something, you know? I really did. But he speaks to people so disrespectfully. I... Every day I had to deal with him, I cringed. I'm not even going to lie. And yes, I did what I had to do. I want you guys to understand who's watching this show. I'm not saying he did anything against my will. I chose to do it, okay? Mm -hmm. But it's unfortunate that I had to. And this is what I want to talk to you about. As women in this industry, sometimes we got to do things that we really don't want to do to make it and to do things and to get what you want. He promised me, yes, I needed the opportunity, but I make my money. So it's I make true millions that he with does. all my other businesses. So I didn't need it for the money. I wanted the opportunity. That was it. 
So it's true. He does solicit. Absolutely. If I, I did not do show, what I did, mm-hmm. if I did not do what I did, I wouldn't have been on the show. If I and I'm, I, let's. Well, One how more much chance. is he paying though? Besides dick, what is he paying? What comes with the dick in the show? Uh, well, the cast. Know, let's just say I got more than fifty thousand. Let's just say that. Okay. okay. And let's just say. Now, was he with his fiance at the time? Girl, mm-hmm. they're not even engaged. But let's 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 that's not even the case. Shots I'm fired. Not, I'm not even here to bash Janisha because I feel for her as a woman. I do. I'm not trying to bash no woman, okay? Because it's not what I'm mm-hmm. here for. I'm all about girl power and sticking together and whatnot. I don't want to talk on nobody else's problems, okay? Okay. But I'm gonna speak on my truth, and okay. my truth is that. People decided to do what they did, and she was there right beside me, laying in the bed while we there kissing and fucking and whatever the fuck. Y'all did threesomes? Yes. Okay? All of that. Honey, get off your phone. We all need to Oh, okay. Okay. He, he, but, you know, street dudes, they there. I don't even bother them. I'm girl, like, he working. But it's, it's just like, it was just too much. It was too much. And when the contract was over, I was like, deuces. I would have never brought this up if... West and say, why didn't you take your show to Zeus? Because we got a new TV show called Betty and the Beast. Okay. It's airing on Urban Flicks TV, not okay. Netflix. What happened was after seeing that clip and hearing her say her piece, it's it's pretty much given you did what a lot of us are saying, sis. You know, you gave up the cookie because you wanted the spot. And I think her her putting this out there, like she said, wasn't to try to expose anyone. Da da da. She said it was really because she was asked a question and she answered honestly. The spot she was given on Zeus Network, she, you know, gave up the cookies for it. You know, she's been pretty vocal about that, not hiding it, not trying to put it under the rug. She said she gave up the cookies. Of course, she said she initially did not do it for the 50K a pop. You know what I'm saying? She said she ain't do it for the opportunity. It's been a minute since they seen Reese. And remember, I told y'all in my other video, refer back to the other ones. I'll tag them in this video. Look around this video. It's tagged somewhere. Um, when she said that she had the, you know, the collab with Kanye, and I remember a few years back, she said she had a run-in with Jay-Z. So, of course, messing with those big wigs and things and trying to get your opportunity fell through. So, now, she is gone around with this new reality show, but she's just discussing what she's been through. But you can kind of see that she does have some type of um, background in the industry. Because even when she first was on One More Chance 2, I did my research because I never knew her. But she seemed talented. She came into the audition singing opera. And I was like, okay. You know, Zeus giving it up because I was used to Roly. You know what I'm saying? So, when I seen her, I was like, let me look her up. She's done music videos and stuff. And she's been around for a minute. But I think maybe she felt like I'm not doing that again. You know what I'm saying? Like, she felt like Lemmy was the last straw for her. I really do believe her. When she was trying to get Tasha K to relate to her, when she said, you know what we go through. You know what women go through in the industry. Now, and the thing I want to tell you, Reese, is not every woman goes through that same thing. And and so many, and I hate to say it, people who have trauma from it, we got to stop thinking that other people have gone through it too. Because I'm not sure she has, because even when she said that to Tasha, Tasha looking at her like, uh-uh, I ain't doing that. So, you know, it's not everybody who's willing to do it, but... Hopefully her putting it out there will help her get some views for her show. Have y'all seen the show? I don't have Urban Flicks, but anyone who does, what do you think about her show, Baddie and the Beast? Is it worth a check out or two? If they put the first episode on YouTube, I probably will watch it and review it for y'all. But let me know what y'all think about this clip. <laughs> Side note, how y'all think her husband feels? I mean, I'm sure they have these conversations before the interviews, but I was wondering, like, how would he feel sitting in there hearing her talk about threesomes and handling the situation? But Tasha K say he's a street dude. She said he's straight street with it, straight gully with it, straight wild with it. I know also in the interview, this clip wasn't in this video, but they also talked about his relationship with Black China and other women so he's been around too but they just found each other so they spilling tea but as far as the zoo situation y'all it's not surprising me anymore you know when these girls say you know let me handle me he handled me now we know he ain't married now we know it ain't like a forceful situation if this woman who's 411 said that she had to pick up this man and position him in different positions in a bedroom 
Oh, Lord, I think what some of y'all been telling me from the beginning must be true that, you know, they choosing to do it. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, what's tea? But like Reese saying, it's an opportunity. So some people willing to do it all. But I just wanted to follow up on the story. So this is now part three. I don't know if any other, you know, tea is going to come out. But I wanted to follow up because I know people wanted to hear more about what she had to say. One thing I will say and give her kudos for she only really name drops herself. I feel like Sharice, especially her being a Capricorn, she probably knows a little bit more on who else was doing it, but she hasn't thrown any other name. You know what I'm saying? She keep bringing up herself and what she did. Even, you know, I'm um, robotic Janisha land right beside her because I did chuckle a little bit when Tasha K was like, well, where was the wife? She said, girl, they ain't even engaged, but she was laying there, laying there right beside me while I was kissing on them, rubbing on them, doing everything. She was just laying there still. Girl, no shade, but Reese I know what you Reese. I know what you mean, sis, when you end up doing all the work. But y'all comment below. It's wow, but it's not as much as a surprise, you know? It's just not shocking like it used to be. Like if he was allegedly married to Janisha, it's a bigger scandal. But seeing as though he's now a single black male, child, the tea has dried up. I think what they tried to do with the commercial relationship appearance, it's fallen flat. So it's not even like he's hiding it anymore. So Reese, like, why should I? I know that's right, girl. Show off. But y'all comment below. Let me know what y'all think. Stay locked to the channel. It is Baddie Sunday. What you think about this Corshawn tea? Sean, you might as well just do your time, girl. Get it over with. You know what I'm saying? Don't start running. Get it over with. Y'all comment below and remember this. Do the best you can with what you got. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.